Uh, day one, 7 o'clock, we've done a radio skid about 20 minutes ago, so yeah, it's about 7.30. We've got most of the fleet behind us, we've got two 50s in front and in one. We're just under Spinnaker going past Cape Rodney, Kauai Island, past Flat Rockets on our transfer. It's been a really slow day, four hours of drifting. First morning, day two, leg one, sun's coming up, our opposition is all back there, we've got some dumping rain, um, got a bird on a wing straight back there, and about one other boat in sight, one boat straight in front of us, and Cape Brett on the horizon. It's been a very, very tough night, we've had northerlies, westerlies, southeasterlies, southeasterlies and easterlies probably 15 plus sail changes and multiple jib up and down so probably a pretty hard night all around plenty of work a lot of yachting but I think we've done really well uh, we sort of entered Cape Rodney at about 13th or 14th spot I'd be surprised if there was six in front so a uh, bit of luck bit of hard work last night it's all paying off just got to maintain now for the next sort of 40, 50 miles to Monganui. Hoping this breeze stays in and we can just carry the Jenica around through the bay, through the Kavalis and tuck in the Monganui. Forecast is looking average, so hopefully get in this afternoon. And Rob's just about to do the SSB. Cool, find out where we are. Here we are, day two, three o'clock in the afternoon. Uh, we've left the opposition behind, been a very, very slow day. No sails set all morning. Just got wind about an hour ago, we had the S2 up, uh, wobbling along, and now we've had a bit of an easterly filled in. So we're sailing along at about six and a half knots, and heading straight for the Cavalli Passage. There's the main Cavalli Passage to Lewin. We're gonna go through the little gap over here behind the windseeker, so that we don't run out of wind and get wind shadowed by the big island. Hopefully, we're not sure yet, we'll find out. Bit of an unknown, haven't been through there before. But nice sailing now and uh, 40 miles to go and hope to get there before midnight. Cross our fingers, hope to pop the chute when we turn the corner here at this island again and run down to Monganui. About 35 miles. Been very, very painful so far. The water is this unreal colour blue. Heaps of people game fishing. Heaps of sharks. Not much action. So just past through the Kivali Islands, through that gap straight behind us under the spinnaker, but now the wind's come on the wind and we're back onto our wind seeker. Just been the flavour of the race so far. It's had the most use, been up for a long time. And as you can see, it's still really, really light and just three, four knots, about 40 miles to go. Uh, day two, League One, approaching Doubtless Bay, Cape Carry Carry in front. Sailing under code zero in Maine. Hasn't been a lot of wind all day. You can see it's pretty glassy, the odd little puff. We are six miles from the finish and we just can't wait to get there. Sun setting, a bit gutted about that because the wind might die. And yeah, some nice fishing spots, seen a few flying fish. And our opposition, nowhere to be seen. On the skids, best estimate, 10 miles behind. Over the finish line, estimate, six boats. So we're in pretty good shape, we think. So, um, looks like a big kite around the corner to the finish. Really hope there's some wind. Our informants on land tell us there's a nice little breeze blowing on the beach, so we hope for the best. And a uh, good result for League One, hopefully. Leg two, day one, just started, leaving Monganui, about four knots of breeze, got the wind seeker on again, again, heading for Cape Kerikeri, 
where the forecast is pretty light all the way up and around the top. But we'll see. And fleet's still pretty close together early on. Leg two, day one. Just got the bird on a wing behind us there. Standing on the wind. There's a bit of a hole back. There's a few boats on the horizon, they're still on it. Pretty tough going. A bit of a west coast sea breeze. Last year has Fair and Zindabar, M1. Someone else, and then up to Windward we've got Hussein, Calm Police. Gale Force, all the opposition basically that we're meant to be beating. And over there, some old chugger. No good. Great exhibition bay over under the clouds. North Cape up that way. Day one, leg two. North Cape in the distance and we've pulled up in the parking lot. We've got Anda, M1, Akatea, and Karma Police down to Lua River. And he's down there, Valium, Fine Line, Bird on the wing and overload. Overload. Overload down there. It's about six o'clock. Still pretty hot. Twenty miles to North Cape. And it's twenty miles to North Cape, which is a long way at the moment. Mm. Uh, leg two, day one. 9 o'clock at night, 20 to 9, just going around North Cape, Cape Ranga around the corner, we've got uh, Zen next to us here with the Zenaker on, got the Zero on ourselves, we've got um, Who's up there? Bird on the wing. Bird on the wing. And then Karma Police. Karma Police. Surreal. Surreal. Chasing hard. Not a lot of breeze, but at least we're moving. Big two. Like a lot out here with these waves. 